Let's talk about how I became an outpatient surgery nurse and all the pros and cons of nursing in general. By the way, my name is Kate. I'm a 23-year-old outpatient surgery nurse, and I've actually been a nurse for three and a half years, so ever since I was like 20. But I haven't always been an outpatient nurse, so let's talk about what I've done. So this question specifically asks about like OR outpatient um, nursing. I actually don't work in the OR. Um, I thought about it, but <laughs> I did a couple like shadow shifts in the OR and I did not love it just for the fact of I wanted to throw up. So <laughs> it's not like I honestly like blood doesn't bug me, like nothing bugs me, but watching how rough they are in surgery, I was like, mm, this isn't for me. So I actually get people ready for surgery and recover them after surgery and make sure they feel safe going home. So um, I do like pre and post-op nursing. I did have to start out as a bedside nurse. So let's go back to when I graduated. I graduated in August of 2020. So kind of in the middle of COVID and I really did not want to work in a hospital. So one second. So this just flew off. But Anyways, I didn't want to work in a hospital, so I started off at a sniff where I did my capstone because during COVID, like, you had to already be working at a hospital, and they were really stingy about where you could do your capstone. And I was a CNA in nursing school, so I'd already been, like, pretty much doing sniff work, um, just not, like, really passing meds. So I didn't love it, and I knew I didn't want to be there, so I actually applied for a pediatric home health job, and I got it right out of the gate. So after a month of working in a sniff, I switched to pediatric home health and I love that I did it for about two years but after a while I just felt like I wasn't using all the skills that I learned in nursing school and I really wanted to do a few things that I wasn't doing in home health so I applied at a hospital for a med surge position and I did both of them overlapping for over a year and um wow how long have I been a nurse one second so from October of 2022, April of 2022, I did pediatric home health. And then from June of 21 to now, I've been working at a hospital. And last year, so March 23, I switched to outpatient nursing because I was sick and tired of night shifts and my hospital had an opening. So I switched to that. Sorry, I really had to focus on that. So I switched to um, outpatient nursing and I have absolutely loved it. They did like that I had a med surge background. I also was floated a few times because I did have the pediatric background to do our ped surgeries. So a lot of the nurses down there knew me. So when a position opened up, they were like, please come down. So I've been doing that for a little bit. Um, pros, I don't work nights, weekends, or holidays. I do take call for our endoscopy unit. And that can be like in the night, weekend, or holiday, but it is so rare. Like I take call probably like three times a month, if that. I would say one of the cons, because I like seriously, I'm trying to think about a con. Um, you don't really know when you're going to get off. Like we have our scheduled times and they really try to hold to it. But if you're working late, like I used to work 10 to 10. And if I was working 10 to 10, but a patient wasn't ready to leave at 10, guess what? I was staying <laughs> until they were ready to go home. Or if they weren't like progressing, I could send them to the floor so I could admit them. But most of the time, you really don't want that for your patient and they don't want it. So you try your best. So I've been there till like midnight before and <laughs> that's not ideal. But most of the time, it's just a bunch of pros. <laughs> My mental health working bedside to now, dramatic. Like I don't know if you guys can see in my stories like my just honestly my body my face when I was working bedside versus now like you can see a huge difference to be fair I have never been a night owl so night shifts just did not pair well with me and my mental health was really bad because of those but now amazing my work-life balance actually has stayed pretty much the same working outpatient surgery like I have several shifts I can pick from and I do two tens and a 12 one week and four tens the next I am thinking about switching to two tens and one 12 each week because that's just ideal <laughs> but if you are thinking about outpatient surgery definitely try it because I seriously don't think I could find a better job I I love it so much but thanks so much for getting ready with me I need to go do my hair now but I love you bye